Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Mike and this is Wondershare Recover It, a tool that's specifically designed to help users restore deleted or lost files from your storage device or computer. While scrolling through several online forums and trying to figure out the next topic for our video, we came across a query that seemed pretty basic, but has been posted by many Windows users. Apparently, many Windows users are posting about the Windows 10 taskbar missing error, and we thought we would make a video about this topic for you today. So in this video, we'll walk you through some of the different solutions that you can implement to restore the disappeared taskbar. It doesn't matter if the taskbar is completely permanently gone or you are able to see it sometimes and sometimes you aren't. This video will help you restore it back to the position that it should have been at default so that you can manage all of your open tasks more conveniently. Before starting with the solutions on how to get your taskbar back, make sure to click that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any future updates. Now, let's dive into the solutions. In the majority of cases, the Windows 10 taskbar goes missing when the user or a third-party application has accidentally hidden it. So, before anything else, check if you haven't accidentally hidden the taskbar. To do this, you can use the settings window. Press the windows and I key together to access the settings menu. Once the settings window opens, click personalization and then on the left menu bar, select the last option, which is taskbar. Now toggle the switch off next to automatically hide the taskbar in desktop mode. Close the window and if the taskbar was hidden, it will automatically appear at the bottom of the screen. In case the taskbar wasn't actually hidden, it's possible that you may have change the projector settings on your PC. In general, when the projection settings is set to extended or second screen only, the system will automatically adjust the screen content accordingly. However, in some situations, it may actually hide a few elements from the screen, which is usually includes the taskbar. In this case, you want to follow these steps to restore the projection settings back to its default. Press the Windows and P key combination together on your keyboard. This will bring a menu on the right side of your screen. Here here, click PC screen only to change the projection settings and restore them to their default settings. Wait a few seconds and check if the taskbar appears or not. In the case it doesn't, move towards the next step. If the Windows 10 taskbar is still missing, try resetting the Explorer progress in the task manager. Sometimes a third party application or system process freezes the Windows Explorer process and the taskbar can become unresponsive. If this happens, click the control, shift and escape keys together and the task manager will open. Inside the task manager window, locate the Windows Explorer process, right click on it and then tap the restart button. Task Manager will automatically restart the process and you'll be able to access all the features of the taskbar easily. If there is still no sign of the taskbar, you might want to check if tablet mode is enabled or not. Ideally, when the tablet mode is on, the taskbar automatically disappears by default. So if your system is running in tablet mode, you'll first have to turn it off to make sure that the taskbar is able to appear again. Here's how you can disable the tablet mode in Windows 10. Again, press Windows and the I key together to open up the settings window. Click system and then tap on tablet on the left menu bar. Then go to change additional tablet settings and if it's toggled on, then make sure to switch it off and disable it. Also, make sure you've toggled off automatically hide the taskbar under when I'm using tablet mode options. Once you bring the system back to desktop mode, the taskbar will automatically appear at the bottom of the screen. Apart from this, changing the screen resolution is also an effective way to fix the Windows 10 taskbar missing problem. There are several cases when a third party application can change the resolution settings and can trigger different display related problems. To troubleshoot the situation, you can change the screen resolution and restore it to its default settings. To do this, again, press Windows and the I key together to open up the settings window. Click system and then click on display from the left menu bar. Now use the screen resolution drop down menu to change the resolution of the screen. Save your changes and check if 
if the taskbar appears back or not. If you've tried everything that we've discussed so far and you're still dealing with the Windows 10 taskbar missing issue, then the last step would be to use an antivirus to scan your computer. While it may seem a bit strange, the presence of malware and viruses can affect the normal functions and features of the Windows 10 system. So if you have found zero signs of the taskbar coming back, then go ahead and use an antivirus to scan your system. Since you are running Windows 10, you can directly use the built-in Windows Defender to run a scan. All you have to do is press the windows and I keys together and when the window appears, click on update and security. On the left menu bar, click Windows Security and press Open Windows Security. Then click on Virus and Threat Protection and then click Quick Scan to scan your entire system. In case the tool detects any viruses, it will automatically remove them instantly and you'll be able to access the taskbar directly. The Windows 10 taskbar missing error is a pretty basic system issue that anyone can encounter with their system. The good news is that you don't need any special professional assistance to fix the problem. Just perform all of the methods that we've discussed here today and you'll be able to bring back the taskbar without any hassle. If you have found this video helpful, then don't forget to press that like button and also leave a comment down below. If you want to see more videos from us in the future, then make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.